Hi, my name is Vernon Fabry, product manager here at Bardens & Oliver. The machine we are about to show you is the RH700 Flex. The term Flex comes from the machine's ability to change size in a matter of minutes using the Fennec touchscreen CNC. Most machine adjustments are programmed through the control, reducing setup time. The Flex covers the full range of the machine using electronic adjustments rather than mechanical ones. We've been using Fanuc controls on our machines uh, since the early 90s, and it's just the reliability that's just unmatched. This is an automatic loader, and this will automatically feed the material onto these inlet skids here one at a time so that they can be indexed onto the V-rolls that you see out in the center line of the machine. Once the material is loaded onto the V-rolls and in the spindle center line, the feed vise takes over. It will automatically come back and locate the leading end of the material, grip the tube for starting entry into the machine. This is a rotating head cutoff, so the key here to notice is material is always stationary. That x-axis motion of the cutoff slides is controlled by another of the Fanuc servos. One of the key features of, the, of this RH700 is, is the fact that the adjustments are all servo based. And this particular machine has six servos. I can run you know, motion control here through G-code and run motion control separate over here. You know, when we get into certain scenarios, this path actually recalculates a bunch of stuff on based on what's coming next, so just offsets for this path. So we actually have a lot of crosstalk between the two paths. Path one handles all of the machining functions, like ju just to machine the part. Path two is actually doing all the handling and runs all the logic on how to advance the part, how to handle the part. On the output side, we have a robot. There's a cut part in the head chuck right now. So there's a three-jaw gripper that'll go inside that part, uh, grip it on the ID. The next step is we have an overhead unit here with a, a two-jaw vise. It's called the swab unit. Now finished parts uh, can go one of two to one of two of these rotary tables here. We can actually palletize it. We fill it, we fill it on the opposite side and then trigger the operator to uh, exchange the baskets. From the CNC, we can launch M codes to, to drive the robot, you know, to, to call in each M code, corresponding M code with the corresponding program here. So if I call M73 here, it selects program number 73 here, which calls another program labeled M73, okay. so that I can essentially drive the robot from the CNC. We have machines in the U.S., Canada, South America, and Australia. We've probably got 20 in the field, but if you include our CNCs, we've got hundreds of units operating in the field with the FANA control. The RH series follows a long-standing Bardens and Oliver tradition of long tubes in, finished parts out, one system, one process.